Hey everyone, I'm Nano Elite 666 and you are watching me play the Guild Wars 2 Living Story. We are back with part 3 of Season 2. This is the first part of the Dragon's Reach. Part 1. Part 2 to come probably in two weeks. So, we are moving on with various things that are happening in the world. If you recall last time we left off with having used Scarlet's Machine and taking really bad acid trip and deciding that we need to go see the pale tree so let's continue on I've been watching the trade. check Why my mail the pale tree will see us dear carabon reaver the pale tree has agreed to an audience but she wishes to speak with you personally i'm already in the grove with rocks and bram we'll wait for you here please come at your earliest convenience sincerely casimir so we are off. Goodbye, frame rate. Off to visit the pale tree in the Silvari land of the grove. Interested to see where this part is going because the trailer that they released had some pretty interesting things looking like they were going to be going on. So, I'll just have to wait and see what happens. You've heard the old saying about not. This chapter is the Dragon's Reach. I wonder if that means we're going to go somewhere and lure a dragon. To our location and then beat him up and then oh haha ha, it's marked on my map beat up the dragon and then ride him to the secret lair of the other dragons to beat up their leader wait wrong game All right, so here we are at the grove. I require to go down. Maybe. No, I didn't need to go down. I just jumped because, well, jumping is fun. They give you a Z axis to play with, and you suddenly must jump off everything. Your frame rate. There must be a cat nearby. Funny that. It won't matter. Haha, <laughs> 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 silly me. Why is my frame rate so low? I tried it once. But the coffin nearly drove me soundless. <laughs> Homegrown I saw it here too. <laughs> Before I start this, I'm going to restart my game. See if I can't get the frame rate back. Be right back! Alright, so I think I'm just going to blame... Blah, 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 blame real frame. Can't talk anymore. Alright. Rallying call... That Silvar is not wearing any pants. Suddenly, I am magically up here before I left the bottom. It always does that. All right, meet with your companions. We'll wait here so you can talk to the pale tree in private. Oh, and Marjorie sent her regards, by the way. So you saw her? Yes, she's okay. I missed the funeral, but I got to spend a little time with her. She'll be back with us soon. I'm glad to hear that. Rox! Hi, how are you feeling? Any residual gunk left over after Omed's device got its sparks in you? Nothing physical. Just worried about the Morjaboth situation. Me too. Here's hoping this can help us. This being can help us. If she's as powerful and wise as you say, then your discussion with her will be interesting. Very true. And Bram. Hey, I heard from Timey. She's gone back to write a sum. Apparently, she has schooling to catch up on, the little vagabond. 
I'm glad she'll be safer there. Thanks for coming. Are you kidding? I wouldn't miss this for the world. We don't have talking trees where I come from. I'll let you know what she says. Alright, let's talk to the pale tree. Or we'll talk to the warden guy. Maybe. Hello, Kazmir. I've been hearing a lot about you. You're the one who unveiled the Nightmare Tower, aren't you? That was a team effort. I wouldn't have made it out alive without my friends. Especially this one here. Hello. I heard you fought Zaitan beside Kaith. It's an honor to meet you. Our beloved mother is ready to see you. If you would follow me. <laughs> what a delight to see you. Please, allow me to present your guest. Destroyer of Zaitan and commander of the Pact. I am eager to hear what it is you wish to discuss. I've been here before. Speak with the pale tree about Morgoth. I know you. You were here with Traherne, and you accompanied blah, 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 accompanied him on his vision of the Pact's future, Kirabone Reaver. It is good to see you looking so well, and you lovely as always. Would I really? Would a Char really think? Kaith mm. has spoken your name to me in her tales of Zaitan's demise. You run with Destiny's Edge. I did for a while, now I lead a new group. Yes, so it is said. I suspect you will do even greater deeds with them. But tell me, what brings you here seeking my counsel? Two things. First, I had a vision. You figured prominently in it. I'm intrigued. Tell me more. What was it about? Where did you have this vision? In an Asuran device Scarlet used to see the Eternal Alchemy. I saw it too. What dangers have you been toying with? Dangerous dangers. Such things were not meant to be seen. They will crack your mind. I didn't understand much of the vision, but you were at the center. If this was the device that Kiara used, then it must have maintained some of her touch upon it. But I do not know what it could mean. Only you can know that. Maybe in time. What about Mordramoth? You know it's been active? It is true. The Elder Dragon Mordramoth has reached full awareness. <sighs> no. I've known since the moment we heard the roar. Lokin, would you kindly find Nyam and ask her to come to speak with me? Of course. I'll return with her <gasps> no. as quickly as I can. He sounded very distraught. I had to send him away. What we have to discuss is too serious. I want to hear your thoughts on this. Tell me, what do you know about Mordramoth? It's dragon. And it's going to try and kill us all. Just like the rest of the dragons. Please, Kira Bunriver, tell me all you know of Mordramoth's activities. I've been waiting to see how it would make its move while reinforcing our security here in the grove. It's been killing people. It attacked Fort Salma and Concordia. And its minions, they've spread far. We've encountered them far to the east and west as close as Brisbane Wildlands. And soon? Or so soon. So soon? And so close. This has not bode well. Please continue. Salma and Concordia were destroyed by its giant thorn vines. I have to scratch my ear. This is troubling news. There's more. The minions are attracted to waypoints. They destroy them. I understand. The situation is dire. If the Elder Dragon's reach is too great, is that great, the entirety of Tyria is at risk. What do you recommend we do? We need to inform the world's leaders and get them to join ranks. I see. Summit then. I could host such a gathering if you can convince them to come. Who do you plan to invite? Imperator Smoter, of course. And a leader from each of the other races. I leave it in your hands, then will I prepare here. You did the right thing, bringing this to me. I am happy to help you. My friends and I will do whatever we must to get them all here. I wonder if I would pick a different person if I was of a different race. Probably my own racial leader. Regroup with companions. That seemed to go well. She agreed. What do we do now? Kill a dragon. Or talk to Cass. What's the plan? Get the world leaders here. With her name on the summit, they just might come. But who and how? We split up. Get to whomever you can. The highest ranking in your home city. So, you want me to get someone from Divinity's Reach? The Queen? And Rox is going to the Black Citadel? And Bram will go to Holbrook. I'll help you all. We can do it together. That's comfort. Thanks. Alright, we can do this. Yes, we can. I won't get an audience with the Queen. But I can speak with Countess Anise. Nervous? I know you've had, uh, issues with your people. No, I'm fine. I just haven't had to speak with Countess Anise or the Queen for a while. 
Not since my father. I suppose I'll have to toughen up and talk to Tribune Brimstone. I won't get anywhere near Smoter. Yeah, and I'll have to return to Holbrook. Hey, Last will. time I saw White Bear, I could walk right there. up to him in his office and say, "Hey, oh, what's up?" Do this. It's important. And afterward, we'll meet up again. Not every battle is fun, I suppose. Before I head to Holbrook, I should find Timey. She's in Radasum. Maybe she can talk to Zoja about getting an Asuran leader at the summit. But in their mind, she's just a student. No one there pays much attention to her. I know, but she's got Zoja's ear. It's worth a shot. If she fails, we'll send in the boss to convince Zoja. They're friends. Well, we have everything covered. Send word to each other when things are squared away, yes? Deal. Guess all we have to hope for is that everyone agrees to show up. Once we get them in one place, we can worry about convincing them to join forces. The world coming together in support of a single cause? Yeah, that'll happen. That sort of worked before. For luck. Oh, rocks. Please. I don't think the Pale Tree is going to uh, appreciate spitting on her floor. You've received a note from Timey titled Mordramoth's Reach. Hello! The Asuran news updates are saying that vines matching the recent attacks at Fort Concordia and Fort Sama have appeared in the Iron Marches. That's not good. That's all the way on the other side of the continent. If this proves true, Mordramoth's reach may be even greater than any have anticipated. I surmise that it's in our best interest for you to investigate these reports. Timey, better let the others know about this. Ah. Is that letter from Marjorie? No, sorry, from Timey. They spotted Mordrum in the Iron Marches area. Iron Marches? Sorry to put in, but she did she mention the Black Citadel? Have they been hit? She didn't say more than that, but I'm going to investigate. That's a good idea. The more information we have, the better. I'll head to Divinity's Reach and request an audience with Countess Anise. Good luck. Meet me at the Leyline Hub after you speak with the Countess. I'll come as soon as I know something. Great. Thanks, Casimir. Alright, it looks like that's it for this. I get stuff. Nothing like the spoils of war. So we start this chapter off with not violence. Alrighty. Well, ladies and gentlemen, looks like that's going to be it for this first part here. A short bit with lots of talking and deciding what we're all going to do. Uh, as always, hope you enjoyed non-violent and action-y as it may have been. As always, if you have any suggestions of things you think I should play or Goofy Guild Wars shit I should do, or if you just want to let me know how I'm doing, just drop me a comment in the box below. I'll get this one day. Let's try this one. Yes, this one looks better. Drop me a line, comment in the box below the video, and who knows, I may end up playing it someday, because eventually I'll run out of things to play if I can motivate myself to play the rest of my Steam library. Anyways, in the meantime, ladies and gentlemen, I'm NanoElite666. I thank you all for watching, and I will see you all next time.